Sea of Thieves, written by Jeremy Whitley, illustrated by Roald Marcellius. Welcome to the Sea of Thieves. Brimming with drama, doubloons, and untold skullduggery, the Sea of Thieves is a strange and treacherous stretch of ocean where dastardly scallywags the world over flock to test their might and metal. Join us on a tale of danger and discovery as we follow the legend of two of the hardiest crews ever to brave its turbulent waters. Who will be the first to claim the treasure that awaits them? And who will be the first to walk the plank? You're sure about this, DeMarco? I could have sworn you told me the messenger said to meet at eight. You worry too much, Rin. He said nine. Besides, the letter said I needed my father's compass as proof of identity. It's not like he'll give it to the wrong man. You'd better be right. You're already not paying me what I'm worth on this. Listen, Rin, have I let you down yet? You recruited me after attempting to pick my pocket. That was before I knew you were a champion marksman. Markswoman. And then you offered me more money than you had. But I cut you in on this. The biggest score in history. This was my point. You've been nothing but a letdown. The score is the only reason I'm here. I like this aggression. You're going to do great on the Sea of Thieves. And if I don't make it there, I'm going to take my pay out of your hide, understand? Miss Arai, you are talking to the son of the greatest pirate who ever lived. Can you not shut that off for like five minutes? My charm? I'm afraid not. It's part of the package. Ugh. Well, I'm sure there are plenty of fine folks here who will find me appealing. And if they come between me and my pay, I'll shoot them. Fair enough. Welcome to the place that's more my home than anywhere else. My father's tavern. The unfired pistol. What a pit. Uh, pardon me. Here's to the man himself, then. Here we go. This one's for the whole stack, yeah. Come on. I grew up under that bar. Have a seat. Have some rum. Once we're at sea, the drinks won't be nearly as good. I'm less concerned with rum than the riffraff. You better keep a hand on your coins. Nonsense. I don't need money here. Watch this. Excuse me, miss. I'll be with you in just a second. Actually, I was hoping you had a minute for an old friend. Old friend, DeMarco. Hey, Clorinda. Now I've seen it all. DeMarco Singh sneaking into his father's bar and not making a big show of it. Well, I'm here on business. Of course you are. Here to show off your sweetheart here, huh? So, let me get this right. You think I'm his little girlfriend and you're still sitting in his lap? Clorinda and I have known each other since we were kids. Clorinda, this is my partner, Rin. She's... Thirsty. Well then, I'll get you two ales on the house. DeMarco's friends don't pay here, no matter how surly and vile they are. Do you have to be mean? No, but it's more fun that way. Four, three, two, one. And le voila, not a single scratch. How do you do that? I never reveal my secrets, darling. Now, if you gentlemen are satisfied, I think I'll be taking this pot. I don't think so. I think you're a cheat. That's a fake knife. Fake? In what way do you believe it to be fake? It's one of them retractable knives. The blade goes into the handle when it makes contact. Retractable? That's a very clever idea. I never thought of that. Let me see that knife! As you wish. Ouch! Now, friend, do you wish to call me a cheater again? No! Let me go! I'm sorry I couldn't make that out. Who is not a cheater? Say my name. You! Alessa St. Marina, you're not a cheater. Thank you, sweetheart. Kind of you to say. Now, word is there's a doctor in town. Why don't you see if you can find him and get him to patch you up? If not, I know someone who makes beautiful hooks. Are you not using a retracting blade for that trick? That's dangerous. Of course I am, Mele, my dear. I simply built a catch into the handle that I have to hold. Clever. So, when it hits your hand, it retracts. But when you need to prove it's real... It's very real. Our captain is taking her sweet time. You up for a round of bard just to bring down the tension? Tension? You know me. I do it for the attention. And I'm already four drinks in, so you know this one's going to be a masterpiece. You are the masterpiece, little Mele. Listen up, you bunch of crusty scoundrels. Your friend Mele Silvertongue is going to tell you a story. Now, you know this tavern is called the Unfired Pistol, but do you know why? Yes! Then you're lucky I'm beautiful, so you can shut up and enjoy the view. Huzzah! This tavern here was founded by the greatest pirate legend that ever lived. He was a mountain of a man. He'd steal the slippers off a king's feet and leave him none the wiser. It's said he was one of the first to find the Sea of Thieves and live to tell the tale. That's my father she's talking about. Who is she and why is she so loud? They say he was in love with a beautiful woman and he came all the way back from that magical land to marry her. They got married, had two kids, and used some of his loot to build this place. It doesn't bother you that your sister's friend is hanging around here? Mele is an old friend of my sister's. She wanted to be an actor, but as it turns out, she's really good at stealing things. Nothing worries me, Rin. 
My sister is no threat to us. The only proof he'd been to the Sea of Thieves were his new riches and the cursed pistol he named the place for. See, that pistol is one of a cursed set. Wherever either goes, no firearms can be fired. No matter what you do, gunpowder won't light in their presence. And that's how this tavern became the place to do pirate business. Sure, if you're dumb enough to run your mouth, you get a knife in the hand. But nobody gets shot in the back here. Excuse me, miss. I'm just going to sit down right over here. Hello, my good man. Can I sit here? Hmm. Of course, no matter the riches, you can't tie a man like that down. He left his wife and children behind and headed back to the Sea of Thieves. But he always returned to them. That is until what he said was his last mission. He was only supposed to be gone a few months. But sadly, that's the last anyone ever heard of him. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm such a clumsy fool sometimes. Huh? Oh, no. It's Moo fault, ma'am. I was in your way. I'm a little nervous, you see. Gah. At least it was until now. What? Who? How'd you get my coin purse? Be a little less green. It takes the fun out of it. But listeners, I have something riveting to tell you. The next chapter of the story of the greatest pirate who ever lived begins tonight in this very tavern. For I sail with the daughter of that pirate, who received a letter summoning her to this tavern this very night at eight o'clock, where she is to meet her father's old crewmate, who bears a map to the Sea of Thieves. All he asks is that she present a trinket her father left her. No, no, no. What are you doing, Mele? If I admit I was wrong now, will you not kill me? You come back with that map or you'd better learn to outrun a bullet. You got the compass. It's in my pocket. Stop worrying. Didn't even get to finish my drink. A map which holds the secret to her father's treasure. One beyond imagining. Lies. I have to admit, it hurts my spirit that your brother didn't come here tonight. DeMarco makes his own path. He's never been as serious as me. He's more interested in woman and fashion than father's business. I believe he'd be very proud of you, Lacidi. Maybe he will be, should you ever meet again. I appreciate the sentiment, but you say your time is short. Tell me more about the Devil's Shroud. Nothing I can say will truly prepare you. It looks like a fog, but it will eat your boat out from beneath you. If your crew is fool enough to touch it... Lacidi, are you in there? I'm late, Lacidi. It would seem my brother has finally decided to join us. You are here trying to steal the treasure out from underneath me. Steal? Me? What, like some manner of pirate? Where's the map, Lacidi? You're not just walking out of here. As if you could stop me. There's one for each of us. Just speak to old Bellinger here. Know that when you're late to the treasure, there won't be a second one of those for you. Over. Apologies, my vision's not the same since I lost the eye. I misjudge distances. Anyway, DeMarco, I'll see you on the Sea of Thieves. May the best pirate win. Who are you that calls the beloved and eloquent Mele Silvertongue a liar? Me? I'm Rinarai, world-renowned sharpshooter who doesn't need a flashy last name that tells people what I do. Well, Miss Sharpshooter, if you had opened your ears and listened to my story, you'd know that guns don't fire here. So in here, you're just a fancy blouse and a bad at it. Shut up! Thump! I see you outside this tavern. The ball will come clean out the other end. You must think you're a real bad woman. Think you can come in here, run your mouth. Swoosh! And not have to accept the consequences of the back. Gah. Somebody help her, she's choking. Catch her. What happened? You think anybody ever died choking on a bullet before? Excuse me, I'm a doctor. Please let me get to her. Wah! He said move. Whoa. Thank you, my friend. You're a doctor. If I can punch down right here, I might be able to push enough air out to expel the ball. Do it. Here goes nothing. Well, look at you, Patches. You did it. Please, just Naveed will do. Alessia, tell me something. Anything, Mele. What do you need? I need to know if that woman is still sitting at her table. Yes, she's there. Why do you... Ah, I'm going to kill you. Ugh. You men, throw that woman out of the tavern. Check your pockets. While Loudmouth here was entertaining you, her partner was stealing your money. Guys, come on. You really think I would... If you want to get to her, you'll have to go through me. Could you be any greener? Alessia, we got to get out of here before my brother... Oh, come on. Sorry, I'm a little busy, Cap. Hey, Cap. Did you get the map? The... Who did you tell about the map? It's supposed to be a secret. Oh. She told everybody. Blabbed it to the whole tavern. You shut up, you're not in our crew. When I'm done, you won't be either. Cap, some help please. Crack! Good punch. Wait for me outside, Mele. Get off my people, you lout. She stole my money. You're a pirate, get used to it. See, Mark, you planning on jumping in any time? I'm a soldier. I don't fight if I ain't getting paid to. Well, the rest of your crew is getting beat up. No more than they deserve. They started it. Ah, so you're with the group headed to the Sea of Thieves. I'd love to see that place. Thought you were a doctor. They say there are all sorts of exotic plants and animals there. I might discover a new remedy. We need to get out of here before my brother figures out what just happened. What did happen? 
Naveed, follow. Oh, okay. My brother misplaced his identification. I always liked this compass. Lesidi, where's my sister? If she's the one with the eye patch and the mean right hook, she dropped me and headed for the door. You got the map? She stole my compass. He wouldn't give me the map. We have to catch her and I don't even have a crew. Sir, my name is Philip and I'm looking for work on a ship. Good, you're hired. How much do you want? I mean, what's reasonable? What do you usually pay? Well, you're definitely hired. Come on, we'll iron it out while we find somebody else at the dock. My ship's the only one there. They must not have docked here. That's sneaky little. She planned this. She's probably already in the wind. What other docks are nearby? They say this island has hidden ports and caves all over. They could be anywhere. Do you remember what I said would happen to you if I didn't get a shot at this gold, DeMarco? We'll figure it out. I just need... I know exactly where they went. you got to be kidding me. Pele, what are you doing here? I thought you were sailing with my sister. I was. Then Seamark said I jeopardised the mission and Lesidi agreed. He wanted to bring some doctor with them. I thought Alessia would stand up for me. We've been partners for years. But no, she said I screwed up telling everybody about the map, and they couldn't have somebody like that on the Sea of Thieves. I'd get them killed. She was right. You're a loudmouth and an idiot. You want to go again, Glassjaw? Stop it, you two. Mele, you sail with us. Help us catch up with Lesidi. We'll get you to the Sea of Thieves. We can't trust her. She's a disaster. And your only hope if you want that treasure. What's my share? You help us get there. We'll discuss it. You in or out? I'm in. You said 30 degrees north-northeast. That's what the map said. I got a good look. I don't see. Wait, they're just ahead of us. We made it. We're going to catch them. Woohoo. Great job, Captain DeMarco. Thanks, Philip. And Captain will be fine. Oh, right. And you can call me Slopper. And why would I do that? That's what they used to call me on my last ship. Because I was always coming up with new ways to clean things. They wouldn't even let anyone else handle slop bucket duties when I was around. I think you're going to do just fine on this crew, Slopper. They're sailing straight into this big wall of fog. I've never seen anything like it. That's the Devil's Shroud. We have to keep the course. If it touches us, we're done for. Now you understood the part where I said that was deadly, right, Naveed? Oh yes, Captain. It's just that I may never have another opportunity to study its effects. It's fascinating. We'll need a doctor. Plus, Mele would get us killed. But she was good in a fight. What is this guy going to do in a pinch? Patch me up after I fight everyone myself. Oh my, that's fascinating. I gave up my partner for this buffoon. Seamark was right. She gave up our whole plan to a tavern full of thugs. We should have made it out of there without a fight. But where is the fun in that, my friend? I need to know you're with me here. Mele is gone. There's no going back. Chesla V, you know me, Lesidi. I've been with you since you had two eyes. Did I ever? I can't even remember. You weren't as impressive then, but I hung in there. Wait, the fog is letting up. I swear I can hear something. I heard it too. It sounds like... Boom! Cannon fire, we made it. We're on the Sea of Thieves and now we're going to die. 